What's up guys, it's Samuel. It's Lucas. And today we're reacting to Tears for Fears. Head over heels. Let's check it out. Honestly, off jump, this song sounds super good, and the, the, I don't know, it just has a, like, fun vibe to it, and it's, the keys, you know, Sam, and I, I love, love the, the keys, piano, and it's probably kind of <laughs> contributing that, but also this, the production on this music video looks pretty sick, and I'm kind of excited to see the story it tells. He looks so awkward, bro. Yeah. The way he's like, he's doing his eyes all like weird. Yeah, just looking on, looking away. I really like the the just the steady beat that the drum is is playing. I guess I don't know. I, I I really like that though. It's it sounds really cool. I wonder if the way he's doing the playing the piano with that one finger. I wonder if that's act how they're actually playing it. There's no way. Surely there's no. There's shot, no right? way. And is this guy part of the band? Because I mean yeah. I know I know they're a group, but I mean is he just an actor? He, yeah. he looks very different than the other guy. He does. I don't know. Yeah, we don't know a ton about these guys, so inform us in the comments below. This is the kind of song that just gives me like Breakfast Club vibes. Yeah. Like it real. seems like it would be in one of those 80s like movies, um, which is a good thing. I love the Breakfast Club. Um, but it just has kind of that vibe to it. You know what I mean? Yeah, it really doesn't. The, the song from, first off, whatever the guy, the singer's name is, let us know. It, he has such a unique, different voice. It's like really deep, but he has like a lot of range too. Um, but this song just sounds super full with the music. I feel like there's just so much going on, but it. I don't know, it just fills the, fills the ears up completely, um, which is a good thing.
All right, so that was Tears for Fears, Head Over Heels. Really dope song. Um, yeah, the piano was great. The chorus was great. I mean, it, it, honestly, the verse and the chorus, they, they kind of were the same, like, like his voice was kind of in the same range that whole time, but True. it sounded really good. Um, it just fit, I guess. Um, yeah, it was a really easy listen, you know. It was like, I didn't get tired of it. I enjoyed it. Um, the harmonizing at the end was pretty cool. Yeah, man. Not, not Nothing bad to say about this song. Yeah, this song was super, super fun to listen to. Um, and it, it just has such a cool 80s feel, kind of like Samuel said with The Breakfast Club. Um, uh, songs like this, we love. So common songs that sound yes. like this. And if there's other Tears for Fear songs uh, that you think we should react to, please let us know. Is this our first one? I've reacted to them before. This is our first, yeah, first one. Yeah, this is our first one. So keep keep letting us know songs by them you would like us to, to react to. Yes, thank you guys so much for watching. Well, Be sure whoa, to whoa, like. Whoa. Whoa. What did he forget, guys? Comment down. Is it playlist? Is it playlist or? worthy? Of course You it's knew the answer. Worthy. So easy we didn't even almost ask the question. No, I just forgot. But yeah, <laughs> it's playlist worthy. Easily, guys. Uh, easily. Yeah, I mean, really good song. Really dope. I don't have anything else really to say about it. <laughs> yeah. Um, Great song. Yeah, I already said what I need to say, but uh, yeah, if you guys like the video, like the video, um, comment what you want to see us react to next time, and if you guys aren't already keeping up with our best band ever bracket, be sure to check that up, check that out. We uh, we update posts every single day um, out of bands that you guys chose, and so we're on like match six out of the first round. So be sure to check those out. Um, yeah, guys, and if you liked this video, you are going to love this one. Peace.